Welcome to this year's Innovation Huddle and our very first Kulitan session. The question of measuring how we fare in, with other countries always comes up. So how do we really measure innovation? Is it enough that we hold events? So okay lang ba that we have these startup events every month, every week? Is it enough that we produce startups? We have invited distinguished personalities in the Philippines, also in the Southeast Asia, from the innovation ecosystem, to share how they motivate and enable innovation. Innovation is putting value to something so that it will have more impact to the community. This is first time in Batanga State University to have something like Kulitan Session, according to Jigs, no? You have your Kulitan. What is this for? The university really facilitates these technopreneurship activities so that our students will have ideas on how to start up the things in their mind. Yung chairman namin, si Dado Manatao, he said, Entrepreneurship is one of the fastest ways to diffuse wealth among Filipino people. It is a guaranteed way to achieve inclusive economic growth, benefiting everyone and not just a few elites. From our end, we thought that if we combine education and innovation, it will lead us to entrepreneurship and collectively it would contribute to broader and inclusive economic growth or economic development. Right now, there's a move towards creating a more entrepreneurial university. Innovation governance is the holistic approach to steering, promoting, and sustaining innovation. It is becoming a new management imperative. Well, innovation starts with people, not technology. Technology is there to support the deep user need. Empathy makes you a better innovator. Talk to your users, listen to them, walk in their shoes. Our Center for Technopreneurship and Innovation, or our Tech Hub, is really the nerve center in developing and promoting technopreneurship in the university. That is the place where our students and faculty meet at the same time. The center articulates or strategizes programs on how to do technopreneurship classes, how to conduct classes. At the same time, all the activities is being uh, conceptualized within that center. The tech hubs play a large role in the overall goal of Pildag. Given the right amount of support, these centers will create new breed of innovators and visionary leaders who will set up their own companies or even create new industries that will bring more jobs to the Filipino people and eventually help gear towards inclusive economic growth in the country. We need to develop a platform where you will be immersed so that you can learn a real-life experience with companies, with startups, so that you will be more aggressive, you will be more motivated, you will be more inspired that soon you yourself will be establishing or developing your own startup companies.